Hey guys, and welcome to this video on statistics. So here we want to know what is the probability of rolling two dice and getting at least one odd number. So first thing we need to do is we need to know the probability of getting an odd number or, or odd value, and we need to know the probability of getting an even number or even value. So I'm gonna use P for probability here. And we want to know the probability that we roll an even value. And for sure, I'm just going to put P of even, which is equal to 3 out of 6. So that means that we have 3 even numbers out of a total of 6 possible numbers. And those even numbers are 2 four and six and if we reduce this we get one half okay all right now we also need to know the probability that we roll an odd number so that's p of rolling an odd value and we're just going to say p of odd for short and this is equal to three out of six because there are three odd numbers at a total of six possible numbers. And those numbers are one, three, and five. And if we reduce this, we get one half, okay? So now let's take a look at some of the possible rules that we can get. So here I put possible roles okay so we can get um, an even number from one die and we can get an odd number or value from the second die so that would be the probability of rolling an even value and the probability of rolling an odd value which is equal to one half times one half and how do we know that we multiply these two together well because of the word and it lets us know that we need to multiply if it was or then we need to add these probabilities all right and so if we multiply a half times a half we get one fourth Okay, we could also roll an odd number or odd value, and we could roll a even value. So that would be the probability of rolling an odd value and the probability of rolling an even value. And so this gives us one half times one half, which also equals one fourth. Next, we can roll two odd values. So that would be the probability of the first die being an odd number or odd value, and the probability of the second die being an odd number or odd value. And so this gives us one half times one half, which equals one fourth. And then last but not least, we could roll two even values. So that would be the probability that the first die value is even and the probability that the second die value is even, which gives us a half times a half, which also equals one fourth. All right, so out of these four possibilities, three of them contain at least one odd number. So if I go here, you can see that the first three contain an odd value. All right, only the last row contains no odd values. So our answer, and I put answer here, our answer is one fourth plus one fourth plus 
1 fourth, which equals 3 fourths, which is 75%. Uh, okay? So that is our answer. So thank you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave any questions you have in the comment section. Don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video and hit that subscribe button for more videos on mathematics, computer science, discrete math uh, topics, statistics. And also, if you found this video helpful, please share it. Maybe others will find it helpful as well. And as always, guys, thank you for watching and I'll see you all in the next video.